Hey everyone, Drew with GeoArm here again to talk to you about installing the Alula Bat Connect into the DSC PC 1616, 1832, or 1864 panels. Um, the first thing that you're going to want to notate uh, off of the packaging is going to be the Mac and the Mac CRC, which will be located on a sticker uh, with a, uh, <clears throat> a little scan device, excuse me. And um, you, you want to go ahead and notate that for activation purposes. So once you're ready to get this thing activated for central station monitoring or for whatever you're doing with it, uh, you're going to go ahead and uh, just make sure you document that information. Move this packaging to the side. Here you're going to see the empty uh, wiring of a DSC PC1616. Um, this is a uh, obviously has no wires in it, but uh, prior to doing anything here, you're going to want to make sure that this panel is completely powered down. There'll be a backup battery in here. You're going to want to unplug that. Also unplug the power supply, and if you're unable to find the power supply, make sure you just unscrew the terminal labeled AC. There's going to be two of them, uh, the first two terminals to the far left. So go ahead and just unscrew one of the wires, back it out, and just make sure it doesn't touch anything. Because it won't fry you, but it will fry the panel, and uh, you don't want that. So. Uh, if you are going to use that method, just be very careful. Um, all right, so you are going to need, uh, prior to getting this installed, uh, a length of either you know 18, 20, or 22 gauge for conductor wire, as well as a length of 18, 20, 22, uh, two conductor. And that can also be a phone, uh, a piece of phone line that you have laying around or whatever you may have. But um, you're going to need that prior to the installation. You're also going to need a flathead screwdriver. So what we're going to do is we're going to grab the communicator here and we're going to get this thing wired in. Now I've already pre-wired this. It will not come pre-wired, but I will show you the connections that I've made so that way you have uh, a clear understanding of what I've done. Um, the opening up of this device is, is really, really easy. There's a little ridged clip on the side. You press that down and then you just pull it open. It opens like so. Super easy to do. One of the easier communicators I've encountered to actually get open. Um, now, what you'll see immediately is that there are six connections that have been made inside of this uh, Alula device. So um, you're going to see the two connections that I've made that are going to be running back to the data of the DSC PC1616, the two connections that I've made here that are going to be running back to power to the, of the DSC PC1616, and finally the last two connections here to the far right are the ones that are going to be running for communications, which are uh, tip and ring. So what I've, what I've done here is I've taken a green wire and I've wired it into the GN slot on the Alula back connect device. So get a green wire or anything on the four conductor, it doesn't matter as long as you match it up correctly on the panel. So uh, green wire to GN here. I have a white wire instead of a yellow wire in my uh, my four strands so I used white for YN and then I took the black wire and I put that into GND and then I took my red wire and I put it into 12V so once you have all four of those connections made we're gonna go ahead and wire that back to the panel so we'll take the red wire and you're gonna be obviously working on a system that's been powered down at this point. So we're going to take the red wire from the strip of four conductor and you're going to be wiring that into what's labeled aux plus on the power series panel. So go ahead and get that wired in there and tightened down. And there may be other wires in there. This is a, a terminal. These two terminals actually provide power uh, to devices, auxiliary devices. So we're going to take the black wire from the strip of four conductor now and you're going to wire that into aux minus, which is directly to the right of where we just wired the, the red wire. So get that tightened down. Now you're going to see the last two remaining wires that we have from this strip of four conductor, in this case uh, white and green. Uh, what we're going to do is we're going to take the white wire, which is sometimes yellow in these four conductor strands, um, and we're going to wire it to yellow. So white or yellow to YEL of the actual panel itself. Once you get that tightened down, go ahead and grab the green wire and you're going to take the green and that's going to be going into GRN and then tighten it down. Okay, so those are the uh, the connections for both power and for data. 
Now we're gonna, obviously I'm, I'm wiring this in on top of the box. You guys are probably gonna pull it in through a punch out or through the back. But uh, in this case, I, I'm just showing you right on top here. Uh, now we're gonna take the last two strand wire that we were working with from the Alula device. And we're gonna take the red wire and put that in ring, R-I-N-G. Now these uh, terminals may have wires in them. And if they do, uh, the terminals labeled ring tip R1 or T1, on the panel, you want to take whatever's in there out of there. Uh, it doesn't need to be in there at this point. This is what's going to be used for communications. Um, and after you've made the red connection to ring there, you're going to take the black or green or whatever you're using in your case and wire that to TIP, T-I-P. So we have red to ring and black in this case to TIP. At this point, you have made all of your connections. We have our communications we have our data, and we have our power. And we also have the Alula device completely wired here. Six connections. And then you can put your internet in here, hardwired, or you can use Wi-Fi only, or you can use Wi-Fi, internet, and cellular, which is uh, what most people use as this is a tri-path communicator. Um, so this was uh, the installation of the Alula Bat Connect device into a DSC Power Series PC 1616, 1832, or 1864 panel. Make uh, sure to subscribe to our YouTube page and click the show more tab underneath the video where you can view valuable links pertaining to this product, similar how-to videos, and our low-cost, no-contract alarm monitoring services.